Hello there, and welcome to the Hall Porter's Quiz. My name's Arthur Covington Smy, and today we have with us a contestant, uh, Mr. Harry Windsor. Oh, actually, it's Harry Meghan Markle Windsor. Oh, sorry about that. It just says uh, Harry Windsor here. Maybe you need to have a word with your researchers about that. Right, you are. Uh, Harry Meghan Markle Windsor will be answering questions on the history of quantum physics. Best of luck, Harry. Who first described energy quanta and won the Nobel Prize in 1918 for his role in the foundation of quantum theory? Oh, Max Planck? Correct. Who, in 1905, whilst working as an assistant examiner third class, produced four groundbreaking works on physical theory, including the quantization of photons? Oh, A and E. But this is no accident emergency. This is Albert Einstein. Correct. Including the paper on photoelectric effect, Einstein wrote four exceptional works in 1905. A theory of special relativity and Brownian motion are two. What is the third? Oh, the equivalence of mass and energy. It's amazing. Correct. Which experimental demonstration of quantum principles was described by Physics World as the most beautiful experiment of all time? Oh, the double split experiment. Thomas Young. Nice guy, so I'm told. Correct. Uh, Werner Heisenberg's uncertainty principle tells us that some properties of a particle cannot be measured simultaneously with exact precision. Which ones? What? That guy from Breaking Bad? Only joking. I know the difference. That's position and momentum, or sometimes position and velocity. Correct. What property of quantum mechanics, dubbed spooky action at a distance by Einstein, has been demonstrated with pairs of photons separated by hundreds of kilometers? Oh, that's entanglement. I'll tell you what, it is creepy. Correct. Peter Shaw created an algorithm that demonstrated the potential superiority of quantum computers over classical computers at a certain tricky task. What task is Shaw's algorithm for? Oh, that's for uh, finding the prime factors for very large numbers. Very large. I mean, like this big. Correct. Who, in 1945, was awarded the Nobel Prize for Physics after nomination from Albert Einstein for his exclusion principle? <laughs> that's easy. Wolfgang Pauli. Uh, you do realise these supplementary sentences you're giving me are cutting into your time. Well, look who's wasting it now. Yes, but you're the one... And again! Uh, which mathematician formulated an equation which describes the behaviour of fermions and predicted the existence of antimatter, and who was also joint winner of the Nobel Prize in 1933, which he shared with Erwin Schrödinger? Oh, that was Paul Dirac, you know, who's known for having a bad back. Which is convenient, because it rhymes. Correct. Who won the 1954 Nobel Prize for Physics for his fundamental research in quantum mechanics, especially in the statistical interpretation of wave functions? Uh, Max Born? Yeah, I think he found religion later in life. He was a born-again Christian. Correct. The first Solvay Convention occurred in 1911, but in which year did the fifth and most notable of the conventions take place, whereat Albert Einstein and Niels Bohr argued the uncertainty principle with a number of interesting thought experiments? Oh, come on. 1927. October, in fact. I think it was an overcast day. Correct. Who, in 1922, was awarded the Nobel Prize for Physics for his services in the investigation of the structure of atoms and the radiation emanating from them. Oh, um, oh, the guy from the other question. He's a Dane. He loves his bacon. It's Niels Bohr. Correct. What does the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics suggest? That all the possibilities of the quantum wave function become alternate realities. Uh, well done, Harry. You've scored 13 points. Although you could have possibly scored 14 had you not have wasted time blathering on. No, oh, sorry, um, that was the video, and if you liked it, uh, press the like button. If you want to share it, uh, press the share button. If you want to be notified to further videos, um, press the notification bell. And if you subscribe to the channel and the message, then subscribe to the channel and the message by hitting the subscribe button. Thank you.